All right, and finally tonight, before we go, we want to let everyone know that this is Justin Prince's last night with us here on Lakeland News. Justin is leaving us to take a job as sports director at the Fox affiliate in Fort Wayne, Indiana. But before we hear from Justin first, here's our news director and Lakeland News anchor, Dennis Wyman, who has a special message for Justin and our viewers right now. Justin, sorry I can't be here on your final night, but I wanted to wish you well and take a moment to look back at some of the highlights of the Justin Prince era here at Lakeland Public Television. One of Justin's first stories with us centered on food, pizza in fact a local pizzeria giving back to the community on Thanksgiving. But for the local pizzeria, it's about more than profits and a good advertisement. It's about good food and a sense of family. About a week later, Justin made his sports reporting debut for Lakeland. But after a shaky one and two start to the season, both players and coaches have no doubts in their mind that they can turn this around. From there, he covered just about everything from storm damage. And with many residents in the Brainerd Lakes area in need of cleanup services, local officials say you need to think and do your research before you hire. To BIR. And as happy as track officials are about the upcoming season, they aren't the only ones excited about a packed BIR schedule. Justin even anchored the news. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Justin Prince filling in for Dennis Wyman. A Bemidji man is in stable but serious condition after a... And he also anchored the weather for again. us. Those averages staying around the mid-40s, low 50s, very high temperatures for this time of the year. But we promise you it's still not spring. It's on its way. There's still snow on the ground. It's winter in Minnesota. After but what he'll be most remembered by is his sports victory. anchoring. The BSU football team was looking to add for their future on National Signing Day Wednesday. All while having fun doing it. Not a perfect night for trick-or-treating. Justin handed out some candy here at the station. Did. Uh, did you greet him looking like that? I did. Yeah, that was great. <laughs> Thank you very much, Stacy. And that does it here for us tonight, everyone. Happy New Year. Have a safe weekend. And we'll see you next year. Good night. Good night. So Justin, once again, congratulations on the new job. We're very proud of you. We're going to miss you a ton here. You did a great job covering our local sports scene, giving us 110% every day. We are certainly going to miss you on the air, but also behind the scenes where your booming presence of life will certainly be missed. Best of luck and congratulations. Well, thank you very much. Uh, it was a very kind sentiment from Dev. Uh, Dennis, I'm lost for words right now. Uh, it's hard to believe that this was, you know, two and a half years ago I, I moved to the Minnesota realm of the world and uh, came bursting onto your TV scene. I, I thank you all for, for, you know, inviting me into your family rooms, your living rooms, your wherever you may have a TV every single night. It's, it's been a, a blast of two years, uh, and I, I wouldn't have traded this for the world. You know, they say... Home is where the heart is. I'm a Wisconsin boy at heart. My, my home will always reside in Wisconsin. My heart will always reside in Wisconsin. But I'd be lying if I said I wasn't leaving a little piece of it here. I, I'm going to miss it here, and I, I thank you all very much for a wonderful time. All right. Thank you very much, Justin. Yeah. And good luck in Indiana, and thank you guys very much. you'll be missed. Thank you good all very you. much. All right. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.